Listen, Matt, you're a mess, okay? Sheila has a friend named Meredith. She's a therapist. She wants to meet you, okay? It's one therapy session. What could go wrong? You're right, Andrew. Oh, oh, yeah. <laughs> Meredith, it's been months since you were left at the altar. It's time to get back out there. Come on, Anthony says he's got a friend, Matt, who he thinks would be perfect for you. I mean, I think, I think that's what he said. <laughs> but come on, man, it's like one date. What could go wrong? Okay, I'll, I'll give it a try. Oh. I mean, I've been around the block. I mean, I'm 30 after all. Oh, look at me go. Just dog out right away. Yeah, this is supposed to be about taking care of me. <laughs> but, so you are experienced then? I mean, Andrew said you do this all the time. Like, it's a real passion. He, he would say that. I mean, he's not wrong with my track record, but... You know, I, I'm really just trying to look for someone genuine, you know, who actually calls when he says he will. Oh, so you do phone sessions. Okay, that's good to know. <laughs> Anyways, enough chit-chat. So uh, when are you going to start drilling me? <laughs> I mean, I, I don't even know your last name. Oh, it's Dolman. Two N's. Anyway, I'm just real <laughs> pent up. Now get ready for an absolute explosion. <laughs> and feel free to dig deep, you know? Really get in there. Hey, it's okay if I cry the first time, right? I mean, you do this all the time. I'm sure you've seen it before. Uh, why don't we just slow down a little bit? I mean, I'm all for having fun, but this seems a little fast. Wow. This is fun for you? That's amazing. I mean, I'm... An accountant who for real wants to kill himself every day. <laughs> See, I, I'm a mess. But at least I'm with you now. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Andrew told me making bottom of the barrel guys feel like real men again is kind of your specialty. What? <laughs> what? Yeah, isn't it your specialty? Oh, I, I see what this is. It, look. I, I was dating this guy, and Andrew and Sheila hated him. He was like a pathetic mess. Is he the only type of guy they think I go for now? Should you be talking about other people you've done this with? Isn't that <laughs> kind of sensitive? Oh my god, no. There was nothing sensitive about this guy. He was just some deadbeat I lived with for a few months. He had no boundaries. But, you know, you seem different. <laughs> uh, Probably not. I ate out of the garbage yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> well, hey, why dwell on the past, right? Let's just get a drink, loosen up, see where the evening takes us. Actually, that seems really inappropriate. <laughs> you know, I know what this is now. Yeah, it was Andrew and Sheila. This is a test. They told you about the alcoholism and cocaine stuff. <laughs> they probably also told you about the slightly sexual dreams I've been having about my mom. <laughs> always looking out for me. Okay. <laughs> Let's just get to know each other sober then. Okay. <laughs> I'm, I'm terrible, terrible at this. this. Wait, shouldn't you be good at this? <laughs> That's what people tell me all the time, but... No, you know what? This time's gonna be different. I am good at this, and... You know, I wanna know when I can see you again. Well, a whole hour's gone by, and I haven't had a drink. <laughs> you really are good for me. So maybe next week, uh, same time, but... in an office? <laughs> sure, we can shake things up a bit. Uh, 
great. All right. Uh, how much? What? <laughs> oh, um, like ten bucks probably. Whoa, that's amazing. <laughs> oh, the benefits of seeing someone in my network. Wow. You know, <laughs> I really like that we both know Andrew and Sheila too. <laughs> but about that, <laughs> let's just split it this time. Seriously? Yeah. No big, no big deal. Wow. <laughs> you really are something special. <laughs> All right, bye, Meredith. <laughs> <laughs>